Greetings and Namaste. My name is Dylan and my purpose here on this earth is to help people expand their consciousness and come into love. Come into love, peace and joy, the purpose that we're all on earth to achieve. In this video I want to talk about dreams and their importance to the language of our soul. So oftentimes um, in Western society dreams are considered um, not important, hallucinations, just they're not paid any attention at all. But what if they were? What if these hallucinations we receive every single night when we go to bed actually had a very important purpose for us? So I did a little um, experiment last night after I was um, listening to an audiobook by Gary Zucker, uh, Soul to Soul Communications, which was is a very amazing book and highly recommend for anyone who's on the spiritual journey looking to expand themselves and to really connect with their own soul. And this video talks about what are dreams and why do we have them. So a dream is a communication from our soul. When we dream, our soul is trying to communicate a lesson because oftentimes in day-to-day -day life, unless we really decide to sit down, meditate, and we can actually connect and listen and be silent enough to listen without judgments of our ego coming through, we can't really hear what our soul has to say and we go through lessons until um, we actually get that connection back. But one way which our soul does communicate to us is through our dreams. And this is why it's so important to write them down or at least remember what they were about. So last night I did a little um, exercise for myself. So I set the intention. Intention is everything. Intention creates our lives. I set the intention to learn to communicate with my soul and learn a lesson. And I was, as I was um, about to go to sleep, I was remembering a time when I had gotten triggered last and it was actually playing a video game with my partner and I was just getting so mad. And I was like, okay, why am I getting mad right now? And when I came out of the dream, I didn't remember what the dream was about, but I remembered what my soul had told me. And my soul had said, you have a problem with uh, winning, with not winning in particular. I'm just like, oh, that's interesting, okay. So what lessons are you going to get out of if you decide to start listening to your dreams? Start taking them as a message from your soul. Gary Zukav, um basically said if you were to receive a handwritten letter to you every single day detailing um, what you need to work on in your consciousness right at this time, would you ignore it? Even if the message was in really scribbly writing, would you ignore that message? I guarantee you probably wouldn't. So why are we ignoring our dreams? Why are we ignoring some of the most important soul communications that we get? Because they're going to teach us amazing things if we decide to listen to them. We decide to really connect and learn from them. We learn to come into love, we learn to forgive, we learn all about ourselves and the patterns, the negative patterns of our subconscious mind that keep these negative circumstances which we find ourselves in going. So when we learn to release, we learn to connect. These all go away. Learn to listen to yourself. And you can actually do it in daytime. I use a process called, um, I learned to communicate with my soul, with my higher self, through um, an audio experience called HemiSync, which is by the Monroe Institute, which speci specializes in outer body experiences. And that allowed me to get into a relaxed enough state, which allowed me to have direct communication with my soul. And my soul would tell me things. If I was lost and I needed guidance, I would put on my headphones, listen to HemiSync, and I would get those answers which I needed. And I recommend you guys do it as well. It's a really, really amazing thing. Go and look it up on YouTube or Google. Um, they have some really great things and free meditations. Um, but yeah, listen to your dreams. Listen and start listening to your soul, what it's telling you. Because it is the one which has designed the lessons for us to learn. We are our soul. We just get lost in our ego and wanting to pursue external goals that we're all over the place. So connect love and that is all so thanks very much guys namaste and i appreciate you watching have a great day